I said, where can we catch you guys next? What event is going to be your next? Um, we're thinking about doing the Texas shootout in, in mid-June. Okay, what are we up to here? Uh, just putting the props on right now, the uh, the new herring propellers, the forged ones, and uh, checking everything over on the boat to make sure that uh, nothing vibrated loose or came loose on the way down here on the rough roads between uh, San Antonio and, and Houston. It did uh, damage the trailer because of the rough roads and we had to have that repaired and fixed, so we're just checking everything over on the boat to make sure that's all good. and. Uh, We'll do a drive alignment here in a minute, check the drive alignment, make sure that didn't come out of out of uh, adjustment on the way down here too. But other than that, it's uh, pretty much ready to drop in the water and start it up.
Let's see. You want to announce it? We do two cop guns. We do a V-Hull and we do a cat. And I want to do the top, top first. We know you. Come on, Gary. Gary Smith from Havasu. 182 miles an hour with his beautiful wife here, Patty. Patty and Gary Smith. 2023 Texas Outlaw Challenge champions. How are you guys feeling after the big win? We feel really good. Um, I think the boat ran great and it's still running great and uh, we had a great time down here in Texas. The folks are very very hospitable. Absolutely, absolutely. How did the weather and everything factor in the conditions? I know we talked a little bit before about uh, the difference between Havasu and Texas and it being a shorter course and everything like that. New props and everything. How did, how did everything did everything go according to plan? Was there any changes last minute, anything like that? Well, um, I'm disappointed we didn't have a higher top speed. I expected to be in a 190 to 195 range. Uh, but uh, after analyzing uh, the slips on my propellers, my new propellers, which I really ran them, here for the first time in a shootout situation, wide open throttle. Um, we had a lot of slip, 14 and a half percent, which is really, really high. So my goal is to work on getting that slip down for the next shootout. Uh, I've had uh, as low as 3% slip in the past, so I need to do some changes on my setup to try to get the slip down. Patty, how do you find the conditions, everything out there, everything, you know, driving the boat and, and um, how, did, how did everything go out there? Well, every run gets, as far as my confidence, stronger and stronger. And we're trying to get the Guinness Book of Records for the fastest woman on the water. That's one of our goals. And I think we might make it between Havasu, Desert Storm, and Texas Outlaw. Uh, we might be getting that. We, we're, we're hoping for it on a skater, of course, in, in our beautiful Predator, <laughs> Gary's. But, um, no, it's great. We're married now. We have a wonderful team, a crew behind us uh, with uh, Vern and uh, Carson and Maurice and and our family, uh, the Styles racing team behind us. So we've we've got a real strong crowd right now. It takes a village to uh, get something like this running and keeping it running, and um, we've got a great support group. So we. Every race gets better. The longer we're together, it gets better. So we're very happy. And um, and Skater Predator has made us a better couple in the future. Yeah, it's an awesome boat. <laughs> it's an awesome. awesome boat. It's our baby. You can, you can look at the videos of the boat running down the track, and it is just on rails. Oh, period. she just on rails. There's nothing yeah. dangerous about it. It's just it just flat. Does everything you're supposed to do, and it does. It just runs great. She's awesome. So. So really, beautiful. really got to thank Carson Brummett for the motors in there, the reliability of the motors and his tuning ability. If it wasn't for Carson, we would not, we would be having serious issues at this speed. <laughs> now that we feel safe, she's just solid, solid as can be. Yep. She's like a beautiful grand piano. Fantastic, fantastic. <laughs> well, that's one thing I was going to comment on is your team around you guys is so fantastic. You guys make a great team as a couple, obviously, and as a race team as well. Um, where do you guys see yourself going next? Uh, where, 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 what's your next race going to be? What's your next event uh, well, on, on schedule? Well, right now we're going to send a boat back to Skater to have some cosmetic work done on it. And um, we're going to take a motorhome trip probably up into Montana and Utah. And uh, we'll get it all ready for Desert Storm next year. But in the meantime, when I do get it back together, probably sometime in September, October, we'll be out there testing the props and trying to get those slip numbers down 
and getting ready for the next event. It'll be ready for the next event for sure. Fantastic. Well, thank you guys so much for taking the time. Really appreciate it. And uh, go Predator. Go Skater. <laughs> <laughs>